Hey everybody, three days till we go to France. Well, we're so excited. Uh, but we're on the Maluma <laughs> campus, uh, Bingley here with us. Spring has sprung. Um, I'm gonna be showing you some beautiful trees. Here in Oregon, uh, so many of the trees flower. We didn't even know that that could happen growing up in Saskatchewan. <laughs> oh. I didn't even know it was a thing. It's true. But they're well, just- we'd see it in books. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't even see it in books. So I, I, we were, it's incredible when you move here. Everything's green all year and then the spring hits and it's a whole new level it's of true. green. I wanna give a shout out to our school. Uh, we've been so thankful that they've let us stay uh, in a dorm mm -hmm. uh, as faculty and residents while we're stuck, <laughs> stuck, stuck over here. Uh, away from already away from France and this was so nice um, so I go to faculty meeting the other day and one of my um, colleagues who's our faculty moderator now Dr. Kristen Kidney she, she says and Dr. Karen Fancher they say hey are you gonna be in your office during during our meeting because we're meeting on zoom these days and I go yeah sure I can be in the office and they go we want to do something I'm like great and so they start the meeting and then sure enough they they said hey we just did something for you guys um, you know, thank you for being faculty moderator last year. And, and they commissioned two paintings. This is beautiful. Uh, both with the caption, there's no place like home. Mm -hmm. uh, hand drawn, hand painted watercolors. Watercolor, yeah. One of uh, the dorm here, the school uh, where we live part of the year. And the other of, of the griffery, the griffery. So special. Isn't that nice? So, I mean, it was just, it was moving. It was such a thoughtful gift. And, and while uh, my dean, the undergraduate college dean, Dr. Karen Fancher, while she, um, while she handed it to me, she whispered, we're with you guys. And it was just absolutely beautiful. So the support the school has given us, um, you know, paying our salary and we're, we're just, grateful. we're really thankful. Uh, it's mm -hmm. been awesome. And we can't wait to get back to Paris. So watch for those YouTube lives starting season two in three days, hopefully. Uh, but anyways, this, uh, this Chateau is a cool one. It is. Yeah, it's interesting. It's, um, you know, we wanted to like it. It had some things going on, but uh, watch the video. Okay, here we go. This one. Mm -hmm. I wanted to like this one. Oh, I did too. Again, I love it when you come up and you see a gate, when you see big pillars. I'm always a sucker for that. Big, beautiful gate. You'll notice one of the <laughs> sets of iron rods there is missing, but that probably could have been fixed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, the yard here, incredible in this house. Before we get into it, I just got to pause. Um, and this uh, house belonged to the local mayor mm -hmm. and his wife who were a little older they were. and uh, um, and the property was getting a little big for them and so they were just nice folks they like were. I, I, mm -hmm. I wanted to buy it just so we could help them out, I know I know I agree yeah. it, it's kind of enjoyable actually meeting the owners mm -hmm. when you go look at their houses because yeah. it, it just feels a little more personal mm -hmm. and uh, and it's kind of fun meeting yeah who lives you make there a connection yeah um, so here we are um, it, and, and there was as much land as we wanted on this one. The the property itself, maybe a few acres, but mm -hmm. then there was fields all around that he owned. Yeah, that's right. I and what an that. interesting looking chateau. The and, yard was fantastic. It is, and that again, that like you said before, is the joy of chateau is that they all are different. Mm -hmm. and they all have a little different slant. This one uh, was where I first learned the word tufo, which is tufo hmm. stone. Interesting. Um, and uh, there was plenty of that on here, as well as uh, brick. In really good condition and really interesting West. round uh, round little guy in the front and then weird little towers. I shouldn't say weird. I'm um, just unusual, unusual. specific. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, okay, now we don't have a lot of video coming inside, uh, so I'm going to have to pause this at times because we did a quick walkthrough. We felt bad like we were intruding on their house a little bit, mm -hmm. but it was incredibly ornate. It was. So, um, which I think if you can see past furnishings and just look at the architecture, that's what your goal is going to be on this one. So um, all of the windows were stained glass. Leaded too. Mm -hmm. yeah. And they all were very much in sort of the hunting lodge motif, like mm -hmm. deer or things like that. Um, also, you notice all of the amazing ceiling uh, moldings and hand painting and gilding. Um, that fireplace was incredible. Um, there was a lot of really, really rich details. Um, the rooms weren't huge, but um, they were very ornate. Yeah, every room, and it was it was a, it was almost a bit much to take in, honestly. Um, probably because the rooms were fairly full of stuff too, so you have to again look past that. Uh -huh. but, um, but you know, um, it would have been so this, fascinating. Yeah, go this ahead. was they have a piece of furniture in between that walkway mm -hmm. uh, or um, entry there in the middle, but um, 
that would have been one big room. I think yeah. it may be a head pocket doors. It's hard to say. Three of them really. Mm-hmm. Right. Across but those them. were sort of the yeah. only public rooms. So one of those would have had to been our classroom. Maybe yeah. this one I think was probably the dining room. Yeah. Um, that glorious so white uh, fireplace there. I know. Like they were, they were lovely. They really were. Just intense. No, I think at one point I taught, I asked if you'd paint out some of that stuff uh, just to make it a little less busy, and you said no. Well, I can't remember. No, I, I would. I would just probably tweak the color combos, right? Mm -hmm. So it maybe was a little less. Stark? Dramatic, yeah. I suppose. Right. Uh, we'd keep we'd keep detail, but but maybe, you know, we'll just tweak the colors a little. Yeah. Um, I hope we can see the the windows a little more. Yeah, it's um, tough with the lighting here. But um, okay, so here here we get to the staircase. Now the staircase actually had some. It was kind of cool. It was a big spiral, but unfortunately they had put a. An elevator, elevator in the middle, and so it looked. It, it was, was rough. Yeah, it was rough. I'm afraid, and that was all kind of the main staircase, and yeah. it, it wasn't a great look. Yeah, I'm afraid. But so, uh, I mean, for someone, maybe that'll be super helpful down the road. But yeah. that just wasn't what we needed. Now the bedrooms upstairs were a really unusual layout. Um, some of them were interconnected again, mm -hmm. um, and there wasn't a ton of them. Well, you can see a little bit of that. Window, eh? Yeah, aren't they yeah. great? Yeah. Yeah. Look, I'm like, wow. <laughs> the windows <laughs> yeah so the the upstairs again there would have been a substantial amount of work needed um but this could be a real like you could really turn this property around and make it oh for sure like beautiful. if you wanted a bed and breakfast or anything mm -hmm. like that this would have been great for that yeah uh, coming out onto this balcony yeah, there was a over. river behind the house um and there was interesting details about that yeah remember? so i mean the river was super cool uh and but also that creek in front of the river it it start it has its origin a spring uh -huh. like a natural on the property spring. it was incredible so he's we, like we got river water we got spring water yeah and you could see it bubbling out of the ground yeah uh, so it was the, again beautiful amazing. beautiful pastoral beautiful. setting and I love this too look over to the side again you see the condition of the stone is fantastic it is it's beautiful um, that's our goals those are our yeah, goals, goals. <laughs> um, the uh, little statues of the original owners that's just a beautiful nice piece of history yeah, and gorgeous. i love the downspout with the little gargoyle i know there was a lot of really pretty metal. details some There's really no cool question. and the yard and the details were, were the high points of this beautiful. guy and um, i think it was in the 700s it wasn't that much no no yeah oh here's the here's, little yeah that's the spring that's I'll pause just it here yeah bubbling away just coming out all the water you need so amazing great in the apocalypse so again this is like the same idea there's not a lot of you know um landing at the top of the stairs it's just sort of like a little space and then these bedrooms mm -hmm. um some of them were okay sizes but then like this one wanders back to i don't know what and, and you gotta be a little nervous when you walk down and see like a big 220 <laughs> wire just sitting there thinking i hope we don't get electrocuted here there was a good bit of that uh, yeah. which kind of made us nervous about needing the whole thing did it have new electrical or we something? would have but... we would have needed to take in like a year or two i think to work on this uh -huh. one and just delay the program and uh, -huh. uh there was just um, too much to um yeah Fix. But someone, you know, I mean, you know, there's a trade-off. You, you spend a couple hundred thousand less, and so you have a year or two. Uh, and you got the money know, to do it. And you can do it exactly how you want to, which yeah. would be fun. This was I agree. His office. I do like that bit. Um, okay, this was upstairs yeah. in the servants' quarters. Um, more traditional layout, center mm -hmm. hall, you know, rooms off. Again, they were decent, um, and some of them had these little spaces that, that would have been another bathroom. Sure. Um, so, you know, that part's great. Oh, yeah. Actually, I like this spot a lot. This uh, this is um, the... the I think it was the square turret on the one side. Mm -hmm. And and so you can kind of look out all the way around. And then just uh, when you look down, uh, you'll see the staircase. And uh, the staircase, uh, pretty precipitous. It was uh, really uh, steep. Yeah, yeah. You, you hang on. I don't think they were probably taking that staircase very much. But the yeah. views were lovely. Now, uh, the next perk about this okay. um, was... It was almost like a little village. It was uh, so it was probably a working farm at one point. Right next door. Yeah, so it's on their property. So mm -hmm. this would have been their outbuildings, right? Yeah. But so we're standing in the middle, and all the way around us are many, many buildings, and they're so cute. This captured the imagination. Oh my goodness! I just stood there and thought, oh my word! It's like our own little town. It's like a little fenced town, and it's and incredible. so again, Leslie and I have history. We spent seven years working at kids camps. Yeah. And so you're just looking at this thing, and oh you goodness. could make the f most the f I was gonna say funnest, not real word. <laughs> You could make the funnest a kids' camp. Oh, oh my goodness! Boy, speaking of grammatical errors, I bet you we've said yard a few times. Oh, oh man, you, sorry. guys, we're Canadian. What are we gonna do? <laughs> I, know, I know you don't use the word, but not everybody's you know from the same country. Anyways, um, yeah, so here it is. again, that that whole that whole little circle of um, outbuildings would have been very fun to have redone. Yeah, they were more farm kind of barns and whatnot sort of buildings, but. 
again, would have been another thing that we would have to fix up. So, so this one was, we were a little delayed on. Yeah. Um, so again, looking at, I'm just gonna stop on this picture for a bit. There, right in the middle, you can see those, the, is it relief or statue, what do you call it? The faces of the two, uh, mm -hmm. the two owners. Also, I was talking about that turret. That's the one over on the right there. Really cool. Yeah, look how pretty it is on Isn't the top. Great? It's got that little tiny window at the yeah. top. Maybe it's, oh, maybe it's a bell. Transylvania. Maybe it's a bell. Oh, I bet you it would have been I bet you it point. is, yeah. Uh, so anyways so anyways lots of fun uh we uh we passed on it but did. it sure got us thinking about stuff oh i had a lot of great features yeah. i hope they sold it yeah yeah all right cheers